Hey everybody, Blue Top Ranch Homestead here. This is gonna be a Blue Top Ranch Homestead video. Now, early in the spring, me and Miss L, we come out here to cook some stuff on the back porch out here on the patio. And it seemed that uh, the cooker that we've had for ever, ever, it gave up the ghost it was done i mean it fell apart couldn't get it cleaned up it was gone i took it down and i chunked it in the trash well that was probably back in april may something like that maybe june at the most don't know and we've been looking and we've been contemplating that we might need a different grill and everybody that I know has been going so great on these flat top grills. Well, we've been watching and we've been a watching and we've been a, a looking and trying to find one that <clears throat> number one, we could afford. Number two, I ain't paying full price for nothing if I can get by with it. Well, we were over at the, the local, uh, uh, so what's the name of that place? Anyway, it's the tractor supply. And they had these black stone grills right here. Get down here. They had those $100 off. It's a two burner. It's a 22 inch, I believe. Is that correct, Miss L? And we decided, we made the executive decision together that we were gonna buy this grill. Well, we went in and we bought this grill. And today, we're going to cook our first full meal on this grill. Now, we tried to get it seasoned, and we did all the seasoning thing. And guys, there's videos out there of them seasoning these things because we watched a bunch of them. We did all that. We set it up, got everything ready, and I tried it just a little bit the other day. Now, we're going to cook a full meal tonight. And I'm just gonna be in some parts, so I'm gonna put it all together as we go along. So anyway, that is our grill. <clears throat> and we have out here to help us, Mr. Jackson. I don't know if you can see Mr. Jackson or not. Let me get this out here. Yep, there's, where is he? There's Mr. Jackson by the box. And we got Lola Bear. So we got lots of help. Miss L's out here helping me do all of this. Been a while since I did a big video on, on the, the Blue Top Ranch Homestead. So we're gonna see how this comes out. I got me a bowl of taters right there. And we're gonna put them right here on this grill. Look at that. I think I like a couple, but I'm getting them on the grill and they ain't videoing very good today. So we're gonna start out with some potatoes on the grill here and see how they come out. We're gonna put on some squash and then we got a big surprise of what we're going to put on next because it's not something that we have quite regular here on the homestead. You know, we don't have any cattle here that's ours. Uh, neighbors have got some and they do share every once in a while but uh we're going to uh we're going to have some beef tonight not normal thing so again let me say this probably won't be the best video i do lots of videos so anyway we're going to stop here and we're going to get started on our next step here in just a moment all right we're back look at there ness l she's working on them taters we got an old squash that come from right out there. So we got some taters and some squash on here. Like I say, we don't know what we're doing, but I get a little better shot of the, of the, of the black stone. Kids have got one, and uh, we decided we'd try it, see what we can come up with. This is one of those that you can take with you someplace if you need to. It's got the wheels and everything on it. Yep, that's my uh, two wheelers, or one of my sets of two wheelers. If you don't own a set of two wheelers, you ought to. It's 
especially around the ranch here. Anyway, looking good to me, it's coming right along. We're, we're trying to figure this out. We always take, if you want to make a suggestion down the bottom, we need one. All right, I'm going to be off for a minute, see where we get to. All right, we're back again. Now, right here I have put two steaks, beef steaks. Not something we regularly get, but these were gifted to us. And I put some stuff on there, my marinade. This is my secret marinade. And we're gonna put them over here and see if they'll cook on this flat top grill. You know, I don't know, here we go. There's no one. And there goes two. And what I usually do, is I'll put a little bit of this juice on there, this marinade. So that's a lot. Put it on here, that's a lot. All right, we're marinating up right there. We'll see how these do. Okay, I'm back again. I want you to look at that. Man, those look good to me. I don't know about anybody else, but they're looking good to me. You know, it'd be nice if I could figure out how to flip this phone around whenever we're recording. But it doesn't seem like it wants to do that. All right, I got it flipped around. And you've seen my hand, I probably. Hey, me and Miss Hill's gonna have to work on our backyard videoing because it's been a while since I've done a lot of this. Of course, I do all the other videos that, uh, that I do all the time. You know, I haven't cooked on a grill, and I didn't much when I was a kid, because that was, that was my father's place. He was the flat top grill man at the Irish Burger Drive-In, and that was the restaurant they owned, <clears throat> and he run that flat top grill. He knew how to do it. I mean, he was good at it. You're not guaranteeing I'm that good. Anyway, these steaks are looking really good. And we were blessed to receive these uh, as a gift not too long ago. And we've been hiding them out. We don't tell the kids we got something good like that. You just don't, you know, let them do their own thing. Anyway, like I say, we're learning how to get this thing to work. And we've got it seasoned well. Uh, know about cast iron. That's one thing we do know. We've been using cast iron for a hundred years But hey You got to start somewhere and uh, We'll see how it comes out. We uh, Had to go down and get some utensils from the DG uh, Because I thought I needed a different utensil, but they didn't have anything that went along with this so uh, Lord willing we have uh, have some more good utensils coming, I hope. Now, Blackstone wants to send us some good stuff for this. We'll take it. This is not a Blackstone uh, ad. It's not. This We bought this thing, and uh, we're trying to figure out how to make it work. I'll get back to you here in just a little bit. Okay, everybody. We out there about, what, 15 minutes, something like that, 20? That don't mean, that don't, that, that don't prep also. But this is what we're having for supper tonight. Right here. We've got the fried taters. Squash that's questionable, but we're going to give her a whirl. And look at that steak. Mmm, that's for Miss L. And Miss L fixed me up. Look right there, I'm going to have some squash, taters, and she gave me the big steak. Can you believe that? Oh, no. But that's what it looks like. That's what it looks like after we cooked out on the grill, the flat top. All right, I'll be back after a while. Hey, everybody, I'm back. Well, we used the Blackstone flat top grill for the first time to really cook a whole meal. And, uh, I'm gonna show, I showed you the plates that we plated out. And uh, man, the squash was really good. Potatoes need to stay a little longer. Uh, Miss L and I 
had watched a fella that had done some of those potatoes and stuff, and he uh, he had a lid that went over his, and we didn't have a lid, so we did the best we could with what we had, and they come out okay. <clears throat> they weren't great; they were really good, but they could have been there just a little bit longer. Uh, we're figuring it out now for the steaks. Again, let me reiterate. Uh, we were blessed to have those and we throwed them out there on that grill hoping that we had good steaks because we don't get a lot of them. Uh, they were great. They were really, really good. Now, I did get them a little bit tied on the backside. Uh, got them, they were a little bit, little bit done. Not, not a whole lot, but a little bit done. Miss L said that was the best steak she's had on this place in a long, 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 long time. So Miss L sure liked her steak, I promise. And like I said, we showed you the plates after we got it plated up. <clears throat> Miss L did all that. So I thought y'all might be interested in this. I haven't been doing many longer videos. I've been doing a lot of shorts. Uh, we do a lot of stuff. The same shorts that you see here. Uh, you usually see over on TikTok, uh, that one minute shorts. But I thought since we got the grill, maybe uh, y'all be interested in this. And uh, we'll do some more cooking out here on it and, and see how it works out. I don't know. Uh, like I said, we had an old grill. It died. We got rid of it. It had done its due. And so we ended up spending the whole summer uh, trying to find something else that we liked. And uh, we like this Blackstone so far. And if I don't, I'll let you know. It's like it's like everything else. You know, I did shorts on the lawnmower. And uh, when it didn't, it didn't work right, I'll let you know. And I told you how we fixed it. So uh, anyway, that's another story in and of itself. You know <laughs> what I mean? But... Uh, yeah, we, uh, we're enjoying it, and we'll see what happens as we go along. So if you like this video and you like talking about the Blackstone, uh, give us a thumbs up. Uh, give us a like. Give us a comment. And please share our videos. We really would be blessed if we could get our videos out there to more people and get our um, viewership up. Uh, as most of you know, if not, well, most of you know, uh, I do other videos and uh, on another topics, but not, not the homestead videos. Those are not homestead videos. These are the homestead videos. And uh, maybe we'll cook something different out there. We've got some okra uh, still coming on. Uh, I picked another squash yesterday. My squash is about done, but uh, Miss L's got lots of peppers. I tell you what, she's had peppers everywhere. <clears throat> we didn't have a tomato this year, maybe two or three. Tomatoes have not done any good this year. Of course, it got up to that 114 degrees and that's the way it is. So like I say, if you're interested in this, let us know. Give us that, that encouragement. We need those likes, we need those shares. Uh, we need you to comment on that. Let us know what you're thinking out there. And if you're interested in some more of a poor old country boy trying to cook on a flat top, we'll figure something out. I don't know what it's going to be next, but we'll figure something out. Dear friends, thank you for watching. We appreciate you very much. Dear friends, may God bless Blue Top Ranch Homestead.